lead up to being a dead person. Being a dead person is so boring. You just lie there. Sometimes for hours. You are not a priority. They get to you when they get to you. Unless, of course, you have a major role. I've never had a major role. Not yet, anyway. I seem to be getting quite a reputation for playing a dead prostitute. I've been dead on three different TV shows, including Six Feet Under. My agent said again that the producers have been very impressed with how long I can hold my breath, how still I can be while the principals discuss the details of my death, and how I never complain, even when I have to lie, scantily clad on the pavement. I did, however, once play a living prostitute on an ongoing cable TV series. I was filmed leaning against a well-lit wall, and I wore uncomfortable shoes, as prostitutes do. <laughs> I decided that my name was Sharon Lafferty, and I hadn't come to prostitution easily, because basically I was a good girl who got desperate and needed the money. I didn't enjoy the sex, and I wasn't into drugs, but I did have a weakness for really nice clothes. It's how I justify my life as a sex worker. <laughs> <laughs> Laid out in an antiseptic environment. 
No. I want to be the kind of forensic investigator who wears low-cut blouses tailored to the body, like <laughs> hugging slacks and tousled hair, investigating the dead body at the scene of the crime. Instead of being the dead body at the scene of the crime, or the nameless corpse with a tag on my toe, I want to, at the very least, portray real, complex, human emotions and have my own trailer. <coughs> This business is full of opportunities for someone who knows how to play the hell out of a speaking part. They're all, and I know that they're out there for me to sink my teeth into. I can't wait. <laughs>